and good evening. Welcome to Mike's Cooking Studio. I'm Mike. This is my cooking studio. Here in my uh, kitchen area in my apartment here. It's a beautiful day out today. It's Saturday, June 10th. Well in, well in the summer, June 10th, 2023. It is 7.28 p.m. Eastern Time here on Cape Cod, Falmouth in Falmouth, Mass. Uh, East, that's Eastern Time. A beautiful day today, probably in the 70s. Gorgeous out. I wasn't out at all. Took some trash out earlier. Beautiful, sunny. Uh, had some had some thunderstorms come through this afternoon. They're all gone now. Uh, been a while since I've been cooking. Um, I'm cooking in my my electric uh, skillet today. Shout out to everybody, all my subscribers, um, my new subscribers. I had 233 at last count. Um, I just got to go back to. I got to go to the fridge for a minute and get the main main uh, ingredient here. Okay, so I'm cooking in the electric skillet. I'm making a uh, chicken fried rice. Just had to go get the chicken. I got about two pounds of cut up uh, chicken tenders in the cube. I had uh, I had two tablespoons of um, vegetable oil and sesame seed oil. So I'm going to cook this through, and then I'm going to remove it and put in the peas and carrots and some edamame. I haven't done this in a while. I haven't done the shrimp one in a while. As you I mean, shrimp's not cheap, so I got to turn my overhead fan on low. Like I said, a shout out to all my subscribers. I know I haven't been on in a while. It usually correlates with the beginning of the month, you know. So, I may be back on tomorrow doing something in my slow cooker. We'll see. Now, like I said, there's probably about Two pounds of uh, cut up chicken, cubed chicken here. It um, they were ch chicken tenders, a little bit cheaper. I had some frozen and I thawed them out and I got some more yesterday. The chicken tenders are just chicken breast. That are cutting the strips. Got my pink lemonade going. And a cup of coffee. I miss everybody. I haven't been on in a while. Nice cooking videos. Put an app on my phone, a paint by number. It's kind of relaxing. It's a big thing too. I mean, you want you do one, then you want to do another one. I posted a short video of one I did, like the Northern Lights. It's neat. You can share the video on YouTube of the animation when you're doing it. Just too bad it had so many ads after you do a picture. And then when you, if you like want to do a hint and you can't find a, all of the certain color, they, you got to watch another ad. I think I got this up on high. On that, I don't want it on hot. Right about there. After the chicken go cooked through, I'm gonna take it out, put it on a plate, set it to the side, then add the peas and carrots, get a mommy. I 
haven't used a skillet in a while. There hasn't been much more karaoke either. But thank you, Bobby Woods. They're always commenting on my karaoke. I trust all you. He's all had a nice, having a nice weekend. Next weekend, Father's Day. See if I hear from any of my three kids. You know, I'll have a Matthew probably. I got four eggs. I'm gonna put in like the scrambled egg. Uh, they were small, they were medium sized eggs. So I did, went with four. I got four cups of rice. Um, I mixed up white and brown rice. I made the rice last night because when you when you do a uh, when you do a any kind of fried rice dish, you want to start with. Um, cooked cold rice, better, better for it. You know, better results with it. It's gonna um, not too much.
soak up some of this liquid is like water. Okay, now I'm gonna add this. Peas and carrots. Peas and carrots and edamame. Saute those for a couple of minutes. You still see that? Okay. Put it down too far. About that, trying to adjust the tripod there. So I need to start TV for a couple minutes. I'm going to add the egg, the eggs. I'm going to scramble those. Now the chicken's going to go back in. Chicken, back in. Now the rice. Everybody saw these. I got, I got a set, set of four lock and locks, different sizes, um, blue, uh, QVC. They're a good deal. It's only like it's under, it's under twenty five dollars on Easy Pay, and uh, there's a big one with a handle. Um, they're all nestable, and I always said I'm not going to buy anymore, but I wanted this set. It's really nice looking. This one's kind of like one I already have, but uh, a couple of the tab took off. No, it's not a lock and lock, but it looks like a lock and lock. About the same size. Nice.
like I said, there's four cups of rice. Uh, it's blended uh, white and brown rice. I prefer brown rice myself, but bring it back up a notch. Yeah. Next thing to go in some pepper, some black pepper with a teaspoon. Some soy sauce, three tablespoons, low sodium. Looks really good. I want to make shrimp fried rice again. I only buy like a pound of it. Last time I bought a pound was like ten dollars. They're all cooked, drained, clean. Yeah. Was good though. If it's shrimp growing trees, it wouldn't it wouldn't be that much. Ah. I guess it's the fact they're gonna go out in a boat and get them. All the flavor. Oh, really good. Oh, uh, yeah. Plato cream. Green onions. Pull myself out some. Oh, yeah. Look. Oh, 
I'm going to cover this and turn the heat down. Let's see. Looks good. We'll give that a taste. Really good. I want to get my soy sauce out. I should have just left it out. Anyway, there you have it. Mike's Cooking Studio. Chicken fried rice. I think this is the second or third time I've done it. I've done pork. I don't care for the pork. Well, the pork that I use was kind of tough as much as I do the chicken one and the shrimp, obviously. Uh, so there you have it. Until tomorrow, I hope you all have a good Saturday night. I love you all and miss you all. And uh, shout out to Cher and Charlie. Uh, I've been watching your giveaways there. Yeah. Um, so, um, hope everything's doing okay there. And uh, shout out to all my regular subscribers, all my new subscribers. Thanks. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, it'd be nice to see the numbers go up over the summer. So, anyways, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? And uh, have a good night. Bye.